The Sunshine State is set to become the searing state with a new report warning of at least another decade of heat waves. The Climate Council says the extreme conditions are also intensifying and warns drastic action must be taken now. Lauren Day explains. The southeast is having a summer of heat waves and now we're being warned they're here to stay. They're becoming longer. Uh, they're happening earlier in the year, they're happening more often. A new Climate Council report is predicting more extreme events and in Brisbane, almost 20 days per year above 35 degrees. So that it's not just that these events are unusual, it's that they're unprecedented. It includes storms increasing by 14% and sea levels rising by 2050, which could submerge suburbs such as Brighton, Sandgate, Nudgee Beach, the airport and Manly. We all lose from this, so the only way we can stop this worsening trend is to get greenhouse gas emissions down. Some remain sceptical of the Climate Council's calls. So physical measurements show nothing unusual is occurring with our climate. It's just rubbish. But rubbish in the form of coal is causing further concern. Washing to shore at Hay Point, Nimakai. It's simply not good enough that we're seeing coal and coal dust wash up on the beaches of the Great Barrier Reef World Heritage Area. If and when they identify the source of the coal, they will take uh, strong action, both fines, but also requiring the polluter to clean up for the damage they've caused. Environmental advocates are now calling on government to upgrade infrastructure, to tackle climate change and help reduce pollution. A political issue where the planet is at stake. Lauren Day, 10 Eyewitness News.